Hello everyone and welcome back to Sousa Place. It's time again for today's GeoGuessr challenge. I hope you're ready because the seed which you have in your video description you can use that to start your game and then you can come back and compare your score to mine. And I will play the challenge right now. We start off on what looks like a highway driving on the right side we see pickup trucks already. Let's have a look at these signs. 25. Okay, we have the camera. That's good sometimes, bad sometimes. Exit 210. Well, this looks like it could be the US. Let's see if we can... If there's an exit here, where does that go? It goes around to there. And... Let's see if we can go on the other side here. Still good camera. I'd like to keep the camera good. Speed limit 55. Do not pass. Here we go. Interstate 94. Alright, we're headed north on the 94. Now which one of these is the 94? Interstates have the same number nationally. But there's the 94. All right, so we're up maybe in Montana. It looks like the 94 starts in Billings. Or perhaps this is both 90 and 94. Mm, if it is, I can't see it. But maybe if we start over here, there's the 94, and then it heads to. into uh, North Dakota and then all the way down. Now we're headed let's see is this pretty straight? Pretty straight. North-South. That's not quite it continues past Minneapolis and then it joins up with 90 again. So it goes from Wisconsin, Minnesota, North Dakota, Montana but it doesn't really go north-south anywhere except here. So let's look and see if we're if we head north. Does it turn around and does it say Glendive? Because then we would know exactly where we are. All right, Glendive, Sydney, two miles. So we are actually right here. Where's Sydney? So what was that? Well, if we go back to the start, we saw this was the um, don't go off exit two ten. So that's the two fifty five. Is this the two ten? Two forty four. How about this? Is this the two ten? This is the two ten. So we started right. Here, a little bit further back, two clicks away from the off ramp that goes to the 210. There we go. Apparently, it wasn't that off ramp, it was this off ramp. We were on this side, right? Yeah, I, I looked and saw it go around. Anyway, that's a minor, minor mistake 4998 points. So now we're not in North America. This looks like South America. Yes, it, I'm not going to continue because it looks like South America. Brazil most likely. So let's see if we can find a road sign that tells us what road we're on. And from that we might be able to tell what state we're in. Because the roads all have a have the name of the state as an abbreviation in them. Trecho M. Obras. Well, that could be Brazil. I'm keeping a close look out. 200 meters to Trecho M. Obras. I guess this, this is what they meant. Perhaps it's a place where they work on the road. 
That's not the road sign. Okay. What's this then? Creek shadow. Something. Meters. Oh, that looks like one. These little. No, that's a person. This one. That's a person as well. Must the people look like signs? They're usually pretty small, right on the side of the road. Easy to miss if you're not looking carefully. If this is Brazil, which it looks like. You're driving on the right side as well. Can I go any further? Oh! They're done with the road work. Okay, which way are we headed? We're headed west, so... Pretty far west from where we started. Um, doesn't seem to be any small road signs. I don't want to miss them. Is that no? That's just just green greenery and plants, grass, trees. Cloudy sky. What's this? Fazenda Lagua Azul Grupo. Could be a company, could be a, some sort of a farm place. Nothing that we'll be able to find on a map. And, well, we haven't seen any any signs yet. Someone on a bike. It still looks a lot like Brazil. I can't really imagine that we're in any other country right now. Well, of course, it could be Colombia and such, but I thought I saw uh, one of those seas with a tail that usually means we're speaking Portuguese and not Spanish. More cars parked on the side. Are you stealing the signs on the road here so we can't tell what road we're on? Well, it's almost like a jungle here. Not quite the center of the jungle, but I would say we're probably in the northwestern part of Brazil. Is that a sign? Well... That's probably not a road sign. Either way, I can't read it, so... Maybe if we found an intersection somewhere, but... There seems to be a pretty much... Lots of traffic on this road for... Such a long road with no intersections. It looks like we're pretty far from the closest city here. It could be on one of those roads that leads into uh, into this area, like this one, perhaps. There aren't many roads back back here. Maybe this one. I'm not sure we are in Amazonas. Proper. But it could be on this road. Oh, I clicked! The time limit exceeded this before you made a guess. And I was gonna click over here, but we were on this road. I looked up and then we had two minutes left, but I guess time passed too quickly there. Okay, well, I ruined it again by taking too long. And we're still in Brazil? Alright, well, here we have those road signs I was looking for earlier. So I can show you how they look. Um, well, perhaps not that one. That's not the ones I was looking for. But they, they look sort of like that. Okay, well, let's put a marker down in Brazil so we have it. If we fail to be aware of our time limit again. 
over here. That that's probably one, right? Maybe that's another turn. No, here we are. BR one ten. So BR is the state then. Which would be um PR Okay, that one didn't have any names. This is MG for Minas Gerais. So we were looking for something with PR. Now we would Brasilia would be possible. But these are all called DF for uh, something. Really? DF? What state is this? Oh, this is the Federal District. Okay. I was hoping it was called Brasilia or something like that, so it would have BR. Acre, Amazonas, Roraima, that one has. RR, okay, RDRR, and this is Para, it's P, P A or something like that. Amapa has AP. Which one has BR then? PA for Para. Maranao, Piao, Pernambuco, Paraiba. Alagoas, Sergipe, Bahia, could that one have BR? No, BA. That definitely says BR and not BA. Espiritu Santo, Rio de Janeiro, Sao Paulo, Parana. Parana, BR? PR? PR. Could it be a P that someone has painted a B on? Well, it's better than anything we have so far. Uh, Rio Grande do Sul, Mato Grosso do Sul, that's MG, MS. So this would be RS. Yes. Well, we have the system figured out, but uh, I can't find the one that should have BR. Maybe just that sign is wrong or someone's tampered with it. Let's see if we can find another one. Maybe it's some sort of... Maybe BR is the ones that don't have a number, like these ones. That are sort of interstate, if you will. Was it the 110? Like this one would be the BR110 because it's not a state road, if you will. Now, how far does this one go? It goes all the way here 110, 110, 110. Well, not that far. And we're headed sort of west, so perhaps over here then. What's this say? Gas natural, three kilometers. I suppose that's a gas station. Definitely Brazil. Okay, we were on the 110, but further south, closer to Salvador. I think so, at least. Yeah, this is the 110 and 420, of course. All right. Well, so BR means we can't figure out what state we're in, but uh, at least then we can probably look at this map and maybe find the number. Good to know. Next one. We are... This might not be Brazil. We have some... P 
pink flower trees, probably an apple tree. And this is oranges, apples and oranges. Pare. Well, maybe we are in Brazil. It's uh, Brazil special today. But here we have red houses with white trim. No, not quite. What are you looking at? What does your shirt say? Champion. All right. I thought it was a Campoli or something like that. Pity stop lunches. Skull. Hmm. And here's a blue and red flag. And Italian flags? What sort of flag is that? Oh, it's number 13. This guy. We're supposed to vote for him. Okay, well. Dot BR. So we are in Brazil again. So. What do we look for then? This sign, perhaps. Promotoria Forum Distrio de Umbu. And Corelio, which looks like a post office. So we're in some sort of city that has an Umbu district. Maybe. What city could this be? Doesn't look to be very large. That's a pharmacy. It's a church. Corpora Cow. Escola Nossa Senora das Gracias. Escola Nossa, is that the city? Tend Tudo. More flags over here, but I don't see the, Brazil the flags disappeared. Alright. Now oh, they're there. Oh, there's the Brazilian flag. flag. But uh, I wouldn't be able to. That guy's happy to be on, on Google. Okay, let's find our way out to this city and perhaps we can see signs leading to the next city or road signs or um, not sure what that reads, if it's hints or if it's just smid. Well, we're done here. See, we're at the edge of town at least. Maybe we can find the road leading out of town if we go around here. There's a large, another one. Centro is to the stray forward. So we're going away from the center. That means we're getting out of town, right? Let's put the market down in Brazil again so we don't make that mistake again. Here's a, uh, no, not quite a road sign. Okay, over here maybe. This looks like it could have. It could have, but this sign is uh, not really easy to read. Something on a C. The city started with a C. Maybe we should look at the one over here then. Could read that perhaps. Kachewi, Katsequi, maybe. So that's the city we started in. Now I want to see one of. That's one only says bridge, right? No? It's like it's turning to be invisible for us. Well, um, looks to be more uh, east and west. I don't see the jungle. Perhaps more south. Minas Gerais. I was even further south. We were in Rio Grande do Sul. In there it is. 
Cache Qui, almost in the center. So the road we were on was the RS640. So if I had said, seen RS, I would have known it was down here. At least if I would have remembered the last map looking we, we did. And then if we, we knew it was Rio Grande del Sul, perhaps we could have zoomed in enough to see the city. Should have uh, moved faster again. Now this one is probably not Brazil. This looks more like the Northern Hemisphere. Let's have a look at uh, 41331. Yeah, we could be back in North America here. No passing zone. It's in English. And we're going south. Camera is okay. We drive on the right. We had a sign that said 29... 70. I was not close at all. We are in Wasika County. Wasika. I do not know every county in the United States. But I will go in on this road if I can. So I can have a look at the signs leading the other way. But I can't. We're on the Elysian LK Road. 18. Wasika County. Alright. Let's see if we can find a highway or bigger road that will give us more of a clue of what state we're in. Wasika County is something, but it's not going to be enough. Again, Wasika County. Alright. There's the poor camera on the other side of the road. Wasika County, we know that. Couldn't you say Wasika County? Tennessee or reduced speed ahead. They don't know that. Okay. I wonder what that other camera is good for, really. Jamesville Utilities. Jamesville. That's something to go on. Jamesville in. Alright, I've already forgotten the name of the county, but I might remember it if I see it again. Wachita County. Okay, we're getting into suburb area here. Or similar. Now this is a larger road. That's something. Welcome to Janesville. Lake Elysian, Janesville, not James, Jane. All right. Speed limit thirty-five. The debit card, Janesville School, Janesville State Bank. Janesville is not a state. Maybe we should go into Janesville and see if we can find any anything to tell us. Well, we have American flags. Does that mean this is a official building in here? No, it's just a park. Uh, Alright. Hospice memory tree. Oops, not that side of the road. Janesville Stationery, Janesville Family Chiropractic Center, Main Street. Okay. Anything on Main Street that tells us what state we're in? The state bank? But what state? Hmm. Janesville. It could be in Kentucky, right? Uh. Janesville Hardware Sunday Brunch Broster Chicken Janesville Municipal 
power plant. Oh, well, that's nice. War American flag, fire department. But how do you figure out what state you're in? What should I be looking for here? We're definitely sure we're in Janesville, but I don't think I can find Janesville easily on the map. Paintsville, that's almost. Uh, we were up in Minnesota, apparently. Janesville was not very big, but it was visible on the map. Minnesota I usually have those green and uh, yellow road signs so I can recognize them, but didn't see any of those this time. Well, that's the end of the this one, and we were in America all the time. Europe didn't appear. And that, uh, well, really this one was the one where I lost the most points. If I if that click would have counted. It would not been half a second too late. I would have had uh, at least 3,000 points more, maybe. But 1,000, uh, I mean 13,130 was the final score. Didn't quite uh, get all the states right, but at least I, uh, I tried. I hope you had fun if you played it, the seed yourselves, and I hope you enjoyed the episode, and we'll see you again next time.